Good evening, brothers and sisters. Good evening, everyone. We thank you for tuning in to another episode of the Tim A Radio broadcast tonight, Tuesday night at 8 o'clock. We are so happy and pleased to announce that we will be sharing uh, on tonight's broadcast the Circle of Love Prayer Partners. Amen. Brought to you by the Tim A Radio broadcast on Tuesday night. Word. Listen. We thank Evangelist Linda Ellis for what she's doing and thank her for getting uh, the guests for tonight. We're going to be tuning in in just about a minute or so, so we're getting people time enough to get on uh, the prayer line tonight and hear a word from the Lord. And we're just so excited about what God is doing in our lives. And we thank you for uh, just being a part of us, being here at the Timmy Radio broadcast. We thank you for just tuning in each and every week. And I want to thank uh, each and every one for sharing uh, the broadcast on their Facebook page. God bless you. And we thank God for our sponsors, the Circle of Love Prayer Partners, Evangelist Linda Ellis, and Minister Veronica Mayer. Thank you for contributing to this radio ministry. And we still need many others. Amen. We're still trying to grow, and we believe God is going to do it for us. But we need your help. Amen. That we can keep the broadcast, and we're going to be doing some things in the in the future. Amen. We want to show our kids how to broadcast and how to go out into the area. We want to do a lot of different things, and we need your support. We need your financial help. Amen. If you want to help us financially, you can email me at pastoracridge2016 at gmail.com and say, Hey, I heard the broadcast, and I would love to contribute to what you're doing for kingdom building all right listen we're gonna tune in in just a bit so just stay tuned and we'll be right back with more
that you're never too deep in sin, then God can't reach down and pull you out. And he heard you when you cry, when you call upon him. Believe me, God will deliver on time. When you're in the midst of a mighty storm and your life seems out of control, just know that if you call on him, God will deliver on time. That situation the man says it's impossible, to God it was possible. Yes. I can imagine in my mind when Moses had led the children out of Egypt and they approached the Red Sea, only to look back and see Pharaoh's army close behind and they saw no way out. I believe Moses told the people, stand still and see the salvation of the Lord. Yes. He will make a way. Yes, he will. He will deliver all time. Amen. He may be at a crossroads or a little sea in your own right and seem like all hell is broke, broke loose. And in that may even seem like your prayers are bouncing off the ceiling and not listening to the, the ears of God. But the Lord wanted me to let you know he will deliver on time. He, he told me to tell you no matter what it looks like, Amen. no matter what it feels like, he will deliver on time. Oh, if you got the pink clip from your job and an eviction notice on your door, come on now. Even if it seems that the harder you pray for the way for that working with child or that troublesome spouse or that uh, disrespectful boss, they get worse and worse and worse. Don't you give up. Yes. Don't you give in. And yes. for God's sake, don't quit. Because he said, I will deliver on time. Yes. Maybe this does not apply to you today. Well, maybe you can use it to help someone else that's going through. And you can tell them, just look at me. I'm living proof that the Lord will deliver on time. The enemy was whispered, has whispered. But if you don't believe nothing else, 
Amen. He deliver you from the sting of death. He deliver you from somebody breaking in your house, killing you. God will deliver on time. Amen. Amen. You don't have to think you way back. You can just think of who seconds ago. Yes. Yeah. 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 You took a breath and they want your last breath. So God delivered on time. Yeah. He gave you the strength to breathe again. He said, live on, because I got purpose for you. Because I will deliver on time. I got my hands on you. I'm doing this Thank just you. for you. And I will deliver you on time. So don't give up, thanks to God. Don't you quit. Don't you throw in the towel. Our flesh gets weary. But the word of God tells us to be not weary and well doing. For in due season, you will reap. You will reap what you have done. God will. God shall. Hold on. Keep the faith. Trust God. For he wants you to know this night, he will deliver on time. Remember, though, Hallelujah. it's not on your time. It's on his time. So trust God. Trust God. And watch him deliver on time. God bless you. He's our on time God. Amen. And amen. amen. That's all I have for you. I pray that it encouraged your heart. God bless you. And it was an honor to serve you on Thursday. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. That's all I have for you. I pray that it was a blessing to your heart and to your soul. Amen. Thank you, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Lord
Amen. Amen. You are you are the source of my strength. And I want to tell you right now, we thank God for the Circle of Love Prayer Partners. We thank God for Evangelist Linda Ellis. And we thank God for Pastor Brenda this night for just encouraging the listeners on this evening. Amen. God will, he will work it out. Amen. Every time. Amen. He will do it. And you just got to hold on. You just got to hold on and hold out. God will come through right on time. And you got to believe it. You know, a lot of times people don't realize that each and every one of us have something that we go through. Somebody got a ton of bills. Somebody got sickness. Somebody got uh, emotional stress. Somebody got something somewhere. But I just refuse to go through and be like what I'm dealing with. You understand what I'm saying tonight. I, 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 in other words, if I got a financial problem, if I got situations above my head, uh, it ain't no need to walk around like my problem. Amen. You'll never know it. Hallelujah. I just believe that regardless of what we got going on, that we still put on some clothes, still look good, still smile. Amen, somebody. That's right. You know, so just because you're going through the fire don't mean you got to smell like the smoke and look like the smoke. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. But I just believe that even though you're dealing with a whole bunch of stuff, just treat yourself right. Just still put your makeup on. Just still... Uh, do get your hair done still look clean as a pen come on yes so I, that word was right tonight it encourages us today that god will do it right on time he will he has all the time man when you look back over your life he done came and brought you out of jam after jam after jam and we thank god for just being our god Glory to God tonight. We thank uh, evang Evangelist Linda Ellis again and the Circle of Lord Prayer Partners and uh, the guest speaker for tonight, Pastor Brenda. And uh, we want to tell you for uh, a quick announcement tonight, um, Healing Word Ministries will be fellowshipping with uh, the St. Gillian Church family in Hollister on this coming Sunday. I will be the preacher for the 11 o'clock service. So all that want to worship with us, follow us down to St. Gillian's, uh, St. Gillian down in Hollister, North Carolina, where I will share a word from the Lord or at 11 o'clock. Glory be to God. And I tell you, we're just going to go and allow God to just move. And whatever he say, that's what is going to be said. And we're just going to rejoice for those that may not be delivered, be delivered and set free. Those that are sick, be healed in Jesus' name. We're just going with an expectation of something miraculous that's going to happen. Glory be to God. And also for you brothers. Those that uh, didn't make a service on Sunday, you can now hear the message on uh, this past Sunday. Amen. Real fathers, real men uh, was on, on is up on the broadcast now. So you can share it to your your nephew, your your brother, your daddy, your uncles, uh, page, and let them be encouraged. Uh, about by the word of God that was brought forth on this past Sunday at Healing Word Ministries. We just know that God is doing something miraculous. He's moving through the cities. He's moving through the towns. He's moving through the backwood country. Amen, somebody. Yes, Lord. And so we want you to be encouraged. And we want to uh, let you know we love you. We love you here on the TMA Radio Broadcast. And if you have any more announcements, we'll announce them in just a little bit. So stay tuned. And I want to dedicate this song to every one of you tonight as we uh, heard the word of encouragement and as we continue to speak encouraging things into your life. I, I need you to survive. Amen, somebody. I need you to survive. And we'll be right back.
need you to survive that's right i need you to just look up to the hills with coming your help uh help coming from the lord glory be to god i'm telling you right now we're just we just working we just moving amen and it, um, like i said brothers and sisters you might be struggling everybody is not alone everybody's not alone everybody has something different somebody might be dealing with some uh stuff with their children and you know thanks god you know i'm, I'm not dealing with anything with my children but somebody might be dealing with stuff with their kids uh, uh somebody might be in a hospital visiting someone sick you know uh, uh someone bills might be be overdue and they might be at the verge of eviction but 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 god will come through on time hey man you just gotta believe it you got to believe you gotta say you know what it even if it don't look like it, i just got to believe he gonna come through somehow I, you just have to believe it and have faith brothers and sisters have faith hey man we in a time now <clears throat> you can't go into a palm reader and the palm reader do it you you just can't do it you can't go and and, and look into a crystal ball and see what your future is going to be like because no you, it don't operate that way amen somebody because you'll try to be slick and change up the things you you say well if i know i got to go through this i ain't gonna go through this i skip over here but see you'll be becoming weak you know we go through what we go through to make us strong amen because you know what if you don't give up and give in don't you get stronger don't you get don't you get stronger if you hold out amen somebody you know if you keep ducking ducking your challenge ducking your uh your, your trials and your tribulations you'll never get strong enough to face what what may be a head that you can't duck there's come a time you can't duck everything 
They amen somebody. You can't duck everything. And so we go through what we go through. We 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 bury loved ones. We we go through sickness. We go pray. We see people hurting. We see accidents. We see people uh, uh die and leave this world. We go see so much, but we still go on. We see that people hate uh certain people or certain races because of their skin color, because of the way they talk, the way they look. But we still here. Amen. We still here. All right. Listen, your weather forecast tonight, we're looking at a low of 68 degrees. Wednesday, chance of rain and showers, high of 83 with a low of 68. Thursday, partly cloudy, high of 87 with a low of 73. Friday, chance of rain and thunderstorm, high of 87 with a low of 73. Saturday, chance of thunderstorm, high of 93 with a low of 73. And Sunday, chance of thunderstorm, high of 90 with a low of 73. And then Monday, Chance of rain and thunderstorm, high of 83 with a low of 60, and that's your seven-day forecast. All right, for other announcements, we are now having worship services at the Lewisburg College Chapel at 845. Glory be to God. Uh, we thank God for opportunity, you know, a much, much needed opportunity. And we that's God hears our prayers. He knows what's on our heart. He sees what we got to go through, what we deal with. So he opened the door for us. And sometimes we, we, we can't, we don't worry about how the door is open. We just go through that door. Amen. Because it might be a, a new assignment. It might be another assignment. It might be something different. We never know. Amen. We just need to ride the car and let God drive it to where it's going. Amen. So again, if you don't have a place to worship each and every Sunday, we will have worship service at 501 North Main Street, Lewisburg, on the beautiful campus of Lewisburg College at the chapel. Amen. At 845, we go into our praise and worship. I just believe that we, we get go in and give God some praise. He's already, if he if he don't do anything else, he's done enough. Amen. You know, we're saved and we're we're set free. We have no shackles to bind us down. Amen. We we have enough faith to know that even in the midst of trouble, he will be our present help. Come on, somebody. I feel great. Woo, thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. So we just praising God for what he's gonna do. Uh, you know, uh, we can't worry about what things look like. We can't worry about what people say because people have been saying stuff for millions of years. And people we still hear, we still have ancestors that's here. People said stuff then. They're going to say stuff now. They're going to say stuff after we leave this place. Hey Amen. They're going to still talk. They got two uh, They got two lips and a tongue and a voice. They're going to still run their lip. But glory be to God that he'll have the final say to everything. So I don't care about the naysayers, the whoever sayers, and all the haters. Because get God, God is going to bless those that stay steadfast we stay on the same track amen it might hurt it, it might you might go through some pain but if you stay on the course glory be to god he gonna show those haters he gonna show those doubters he gonna show those naysayers a thing or two and it ain't that we're gonna be puffed up it ain't that we're gonna rejoice because they uh, are looking at us and they don't have what we have no we just want to rejoice because we know that god's word is true and he will provide for his children he will provide amen amen thank god for uh this broadcast that continue to broadcast each and every week for the four, past four years in january of this year this new january 2018 will be five years and you know one day we will wake up into a building one day we're going to wake up into a staff of people we're going to have a staff we're going to have women and men uh uh Preachers and teachers to come on and be a part of this show. It's going to be great. Amen. You just got to speak it. Amen. You got to speak it. And you got to keep going and keep doing it. And we keep believing it. Yes, that's right. We keep believing it and keep doing it. Because, you know, sometimes, you know, your breakthrough uh, uh, might not come in a year or two, five years. But, you know, if you don't give up, it'll come. You'll be able to see the glory of the Lord at the latter, at the latter end. And that's what the woman of God spoke tonight, amen, about that latter end, you know, regardless of what you see, what what kind of the position that we, we feel like we're not in. But if you keep on trucking, your ladder, 
Come on, somebody say your ladder. Amen. Your ladder end will be something miraculous and great and fantastic. And you will rejoice into a God that's been good to us. Glory be to God. Listen, we will be right back. Enjoy the night's music on the Tim A Radio broadcast. She drank and was made richer From the water he gave her And it was not in the well Yes, gave water Jesus gave water Jesus gave water I want to let his praise swell Jesus gave water He gave that woman water Gave living and love and lasting water And it was not in the well on that he had pity She ran back to the city Crying glory, hallelujah And did his wonders tell She left my Savior singing She came back to him bringing The town she had water, Lord And it was not in the well Yes, gave her water Jesus gave her water Jesus 
gave the water, I wanna let his praise swell. Jesus gave that woman water, gave her that love and less than water, water, and it was not in Well, Lord, that woman left for shouting. There was no room for doubting that she had met a savior who did a wonder's tale. Every time she doubted him, she started to think about him. The man that gave her that water, Lord, and it was not in the well. Yes, gave her water. Jesus gave her water. Jesus gave her water. I wanna let his praise swell. Tell you he gave that woman water, gave her that loving less than water. Water, 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 loving water, and it was not in the well. Y'all don't know nothing about that harmony. I, listen, these folks out here today singing, that's not singing. That, that's, that's, that's words. Because I'm going to tell you, these brothers here were singing with no computer, no uh, voice control, no voice moderation, no uh, guitars, no no keyboards, no no drums. That, you hear that music? You hear that background? Doom. Doom, doom, doom. You hear that them bars, them harmony? Man, y'all don't know nothing about that right there. That's that old, old time singing where the music was the voice. I tell you, I can listen to Sam Cooke all day and the, and the Soul Stirs all day, man. That's that good singing. You know, me and my brother uh, had an opportunity in our life one time to really do some amazing things. Um, didn't never happen. I don't know. He had a other other things that he wanted to do and i ain't putting them on blast y'all i'm not but we had uh sung for so long together and our voices man came together like an instrument and i'd say right now you know i really was hoping that we could go and use our voices to go and sing to sick and go into uh children's hospitals and sing because that i just believed it but you know he had a, 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 a person to come and wanted him to be on a track and and so we didn't get to do it and then you know they still didn't get to make the track <laughs> but uh we we had sit out there in the backyard at night sometimes just singing and blowing you know those are the days that you know we was on key and you know but we've not sung together like that in a long, long, long time. And, and to tell you, those voices right there reminded me back when we uh, sung on uh, the Clifton Brothers. I think it was about 30-something years, 36 years anniversary at Turtle Lane. And we was a, a opening group, man. It was just him and I. And, uh, you know, I'm not bragging, but the people were saying they thought it was more people on stage with us that was listening out in the in the lobby area. Uh, God has gave us a, a, a opportunity to sing and to sing different parts. You know, I, I'm a high tenor and I can sing, a, you know, low tenor, but mostly a high tenor. And I thank God for being able just to blend in with others uh, to be able to hear but I tell you right now, I ain't going to say it's too late, but the Lord know he will definitely be in the midst of doing it for us. If we will ever go and be able to use our voices to do that again. I uh, love them, the soul stirrers. Listen, I do have the address to St. Gideon, and I did pronounce that uh, Gillian, but Gideon uh, with a D. Gideon, St. Gideon Baptist Church is in Hollister, North Carolina. It's 407 Wims Road, Hollister, North Carolina. And if you uh, want to just join us, you can put that on your GPS and come on down at 11 o'clock. We're going to sh be there sharing a word on the this coming Sunday. And uh, we thank God for, for that. Also, we have the, you know, we didn't have the third Sunday po hour power with the word on this past uh, Sunday due to I have to another obligation I had to take my son to uh, NC State we had uh, to get him that seven o'clock at 745 we had a parent meeting with uh, the staff and the, and the and the coordinators of the academic program there uh, for the upward bound program and so uh, we didn't get back to Lewisburg until about 9 o'clock, I guess, a little after. Or maybe about 9 o'clock, I think it was about 9 o'clock. Yes, a little after. 
Um, so we did cancel that on this past Sunday. But this coming Sunday, we will be broadcasting broadcasting the um, Our Power with the Word on the fourth Sunday, which is coming up this Sunday at 7 o'clock. Amen. We will be broadcasting uh, the Our Power with the Word at 7 o'clock. And our guest speaker will be Prophet Sean Washington. And I'm going to be sharing that again. Prophet Sean uh, Washington, a man, a friend of mine, uh, uh, another ministry that we fellowship with. And we just thank God for uh, our fellowship when we're able to fellowship with each other. Amen. We have a great time in the Lord. And I'm, and I'm telling you right now, they don't mind praising God. You know, people talk about this. You know, when they see us praising God, you know, especially some of those church lookers or those seat holders. I should call them seat holders. Some of the seat holders seemed like God hadn't done nothing for them. And, and, and you know, when, when Pentecost, everybody was on one accord. And when everybody was on one accord, that means that we know that, that, that we serve the same God. And God has been good to all of us. When we come on one accord, amen, a, a miraculous thing, something phenomenal will happen. And, and they began to speak in tongues and the move of the Holy Spirit was moving when they all was on one accord. And we got we got clock watchers and, and seat holders that don't think that they it takes all that, but it takes that and more. But the Bible says that let everything that has breath praise ye the Lord. And if you have breath to praise you ye the Lord, if you praising, Amen. I'm showing a form of expression. Uh, I'm moving my hands. I'm, uh, I, I might even go into a shout of praise or dance. But 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 let everything that has breath praise ye the Lord. Amen. So those are the announcements, and we'll we'll announce that again on tomorrow night, which is Wednesday night midweek praise. Do join us between seven and eight p.m. on this Wednesday for midweek praise, and we thank God, Amen, for this uh, this moment that we have to share the things that's going on in the community. And if you are a church, if you are a pastor or a church that is that is li listening tonight, and if you have an event, then please email me your event, your services, or whatever you're doing. Email email everything, all of your correspondence to Pastor Ackridge2016 at gmail.com. That's Pastor Ackridge, that's A-K-R-I-D-G-E 2016 at gmail.com. Say
took a little while, but I think I finally understand. I have to be totally in tune, totally surrendered to be able to hear your voice. It's definitely not something that comes overnight, but it's something that is acquired only through reading and understanding your word on a daily basis. You have to hear with your spirit and not with your ears. I get it now. So until the next time we talk, this is your servant, Trippray. Amen. Uh, Try Cray as uh, my my wife cousin from the islands um, singing that song right there, Your Voice. And we thank God for the man of God that is also a, a preacher, a young brother, and he's also a dynamic singer. Amen. So uh, we thank God for those uh, that share their music with us here on the broadcast. Amen. God bless you. Listen, we um, got a couple more songs for you on this evening. We pray that you're enjoying it so far. Uh, I have, um, you know, the Singing Deacons out of uh, Frankerton coming up in just a little bit. You know, local talent. We play the local talent. We play uh, uh, Johnny Boy and True Blessings here on the show. We have Brother Johnny Clifton and his single uh, album. And we play... Uh, uh, we got your voice by Tri Cray out of there. Out of, uh, and we have um, much of many others um, that we do play on this broadcast. Local talents. We have some people down in Zebulon. We have some down uh, on the other side of Statesville. Uh, some people that send me their stuff to play. Amen. See, the, the, if the big radio stations uh, won't play your stuff, you know I'm going to tear it all to pieces here. <laughs> Just send it to me. I upload it and people have in, in enjoyed it. And one thing about it, you know, people can't download the songs that I play. You know, they can't get them. You know, I, I know a brother had asked me a while back, hey, man, how can I get that song? I, I, you can't get it from this this broadcast. I'm sorry, so I, I do apologize. But you know, we that's the music we're playing. We're playing good music for people to hear, and and enjoy to pat their feet, to clap their hands, you know, just to sit back and relax from a hard day work, and you hear some good music. That's what I'm talking about right there. Listen, we'll be back in just a little bit. So keep enjoying tonight's broadcast on the TMA Radio broadcast.
and shame but it came and washed me now no more stains it is by grace that we yourself act of kindness the type we don't deserve God's riches at Christ expense anybody here who knows this type of grace he is my salvation and strength have his DNA in my veins since the day he washed me clean life has never been the same again Answer. What kind of love so tender has 
no limit, has no measure. What shall I give for love? Everything I have is yours. The earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. The cows on a thousand hills is yours. Jehovah Jireh, my provider. Savior, healer, awesome wonder. You are the unchanging changer. Even when I'm wrong, still lost me tender. Grace took Joseph to the palace. As thou was crowned by Ahazarah. Amazing grace, thou sweet the sound. I once was lost, but now I'm found. What kind of God is this? The heavens and the earth adore you. All the angels bow before you. Your grace is enough for me. I love you. Oh, grace to lay up gold as dust. You have favor when the labor is much. When trials come, place my feet on the rock. I will be still cause I know you are God. Exceeding everywhere. Exceeding. All right, this concludes tonight's broadcast, and we want to thank each and every one for tuning in tonight. Join us tomorrow between 7 and 8 p.m. for midweek praise. So if you have a praise report, if you have something you want to share that might encourage someone, somebody else, please do join us on tomorrow night. And e either way, I want you to tune in. Amen. Have a good time in the name of the Lord and have a blessed night and a wonderful tomorrow. And we'll continue to be praying for all those that are sick and shut in. All of those that whatever they have uh, that they're dealing with, we're praying for a release. We're praying for generational curses to be released. We're praying and uh, counseling all sick. Amen. We, we're doing that in the name of Jesus. Glory be to God tonight. We thank you for tuning in. God bless you. May heaven smile upon you. We love you with the love of the Lord. We'll see you on tomorrow. How many agree with me today? That when this life is over, that when we leave this place, we want to go to heaven. Come on. I'm going to heaven, and I hope to see you there. Well, there's no more sickness in Hallelujah Square. I'll see my father and my mother too. If you die in the will of God, I'll see you too. Hold up in glory, where we'll be together. Where we'll lift our hands and rejoice with Jesus Christ forever. Hold up in glory when our rest is won. I want to hear my father say, I want to hear him say, well done. It's a place where there's only tears of joy, never tears of pain. And every day is sunny and bright. No more clouds or rain Where we can sing and shout And praise his holy name Where there'll be no more cares of this world Ever again I heard the streets up there Are paved with gold Where there's so much love up there You can rest your soul that's where we'll meet our King and bow before His Majesty. And scream and praise His name for what He's done for me. Hold up in glory, where we'll be together. Where we'll lift our hands and rejoice with Jesus Christ forever. Put your hands up.